Kanye, man. Kanye, we finally got the Vultures album that. Vultures. What'd you say? Good. Oh, yeah, we finally got the Vultures album, Kanye, Ty Dolla Sign. Um, it's a little weird drop. It was. We went looking for it. It, it. it popped up in the middle of the night, and then it wasn't there, and then it was there. And I've had to re-download it three or four times. I've learned with Kanye, you just have to buy it right away as soon as you see it because... It's going to disappear. <laughs> yeah. So I purchased immediately. Yeah, I bought it. I ain't seen none of them little streaming games they was playing. Oh, he pulled it. Oh, it's not in Spotify. Oh, oh no. he changed it. They, did some, they, they was doing some nasty shit, though. Like, to uh, see it play out, it was nasty. What happened? Tell me. Well... Apple's invested in Super Bowl, Usher, mm -hmm. all of this. Usher drops a new album. So, of course, it's going to be, it's all promoted and slapped all over the pages. Mm -hmm. Apple, Apple, Usher, 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 Usher. Of course. Usher. Yeah. Number one, number one, number one. Mm -hmm. And then in comes this Kanye album out of nowhere, which jumped to number one. No, you can't be here, my nigga, move. <laughs> and it's every time they try some trickery, because you'll see the album disappear. Now Usher's back at number one. Mm hmm. It'll be completely out the top 10. Like, I literally watched this because I'm like, I, are they really doing that? Of course they're doing that. And as soon as he re-upload or whatever they do, number one. So it ended up beating it out, beating out the album that y'all are invested in and promoting for number one as an independent album. Mm -hmm. Like, this was dropped straight through Usher's yet. independent too. Usher's <laughs> Gamma. <laughs> Hey, I'm just telling you what he told me. Oh, oh okay, true, true. Salute. Gamma's name. What is <laughs> Listen, salute. All right, we're not doing this chance to rap and shit. Man. <laughs> Listen, dog, Please. salute. Please. I'm not hating. Salute to everybody getting it. But, um, yeah, did, did you guys all get a chance to hear the album? Of course. I did. Not. I, did. Mm -hmm. I heard it. I heard it. I like that shit. Me well, too. I like a, a large chunk of it. Yeah, pr production is... Crazy. Top notch. Um, I think Kanye's at the point now where he's just... Doing arranging, um, I'm I'm pulling in. I got the sound I want. I got the person I want. I got this. I got that. Even if when he shows up on the album, he ain't doing his best rapping, rapping anymore. Even though he did go off on a couple. That's of a stretch. Mm -hmm. He not, bro. He, no, he, I'm saying you saying. I'm that saying in a nice stretch. Way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Boy, that's that's kind of you. Yeah, uh, yeah. This this but, this rapping on here. Not, let's spend a minute on it. <laughs> this is some bad rapping on here. From everybody? Or no, just no, no, just no, him. 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 I'm only talking about Kanye him. West. Freddie Gibbs went crazy. Woo. Rich the Kid went crazy. All the rappers I heard me. went crazy, except for Kanye right. West. But I think that speaks to Ice's point. His focus clearly is on, I'm arranging the song. Bro, the, he's I, just chanting. To yeah. me, I'm not comparing the two of them, but this is West Side Gun on his albums, where I'm not doing, I can rap. I'm not doing my best rapping. I'm more so arranging this and getting the sound the way I want and the features the way I want. And y'all do it. When I come on, I just do whatever it is. I'm, you know, a little bullshit here and there. That's what it sounds like Kanye was doing. I'm not mad at that comparison. Not mad at that comparison. And they're both art. Yeah. You know, they're both artsy dudes. So that's what that's what I hear when I hear this Kanye album. It's just a lot. It's, it's, it sounds great. Sonically, I played it everywhere. I played mm -hmm. it in the car, in the headphones, in the headset. Like, I, I had the album going crazy. Mm hmm I like what I heard, but then it's like I, I almost like tune him out a little bit on his own album. The, yeah, it sounded a little fucked up. Right? I wasn't really analyzing his raps. Too yeah, much. like I don't expect. It's been a long time since I looked at Kanye for like lyrics. Well, listen, don't focus on what I'm saying about the lyrics. I am still a bird. <laughs> so when this, I know it. I know it. Yeah. <laughs> I'm still a little thought inside now. Hold up. I knew you was going to this one. Dog, what a creative flip of back that ass up. I need uh, to hear this in the strip club loud, loud. Listen, that's crazy. It is. That's your stuff. I absolutely love that. One of my favorite songs on this project. Uh, let me get emo for a minute. Absolutely love this. Killed it. I don't care that this beat stays the same. I don't care. This and it doesn't hard. stay the same, but this is crazy. He showed his ass in the production. He, he, did. Absolutely, he did. absolutely did. This production is unbelievable on here. Yeah, I need to hear this loud some way. I do. I a lot do. a lot a, a lot of this album is that. Like you have to hear it in a really loud environment. Yeah, you might have to hook up to the bigs. Alright. I'll get carried away if that's the <laughs> one here. Um 
Again, like I said, the Freddie Gibbs track, I love. That's my shit. Yeah, that, the last Gibbs, couple Gibbs, songs are amazing too. Gibbs probably got the best verse. Not, not, yeah, not, not even no probably. probably. Not no probably, probably about yeah. it. He has the best. No verse probably about it. He went yeah. off. He yeah, smoked. Carnival on Down is nuts. <sighs> Carnival is that. He lost me Ooh. when he got a little too funky. Sometimes there's about two or three songs on here that's too funky for me. Some of the Ooh. middle stuff he got like yeah, uh, Yeezus ish. Too Yeezus ish for me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's the first. Seven or eight I love, and the last like five I love. How Overall, many good album it? though. It's, uh, 16, Sixteen tracks, 16. fifty-six minute listen. Mm. Shout out to Kanye, man. For anti dollar sign. Anti, yeah. Anti dollar, yeah, that's true. And everybody that played a part in this project. There's a YG. I still have to go get the bootleg because I need the everybody record. <laughs> I need the Backstreet Boys record. That shit is hard. I need it. That's the one. I hope that comes on because again, this is a. The, the, the version I have with that is like a premix. Well, a lot of people Once, after he dropped the album started compl- uh, started talking about his lack of sample clearances. He don't yes, care. Yeah, he'll, he don't give a fuck. <laughs> He's all right. I heard you. Like me asking to clear this. Like I said, I tweeted that is a professional courtesy. I'm just asking. If you say no, all right, I'm doing what I want to do at this point. Also, mm-hmm. Kanye and deeper than the independent uh, album, he's, he's on what he could do that. You. You can't. Well, he don't you sell just, it. You, no, no, he's selling it. He's selling it. Now you the, without the, deal with then, the ramifications. Yeah, yeah, okay. Oh, all right. Deal with the consequences. I love what he's doing independently with the music, but deeper than that, this Robin Hood shtick that he's on with the uh with the apparel. Mm-hmm. Twenty dollar mm-hmm. joints. The twenty dollar joints mm-hmm. or selling them for two hundred, everybody ordering, and then him rebating, giving back one eighty. Mm-hmm. Like just Highlighting how people are get that the capitalism and just how people are robbing people in that industry and showing how you don't really need to spend that for high quality stuff. I'm I'm very anxious to see how this plays out. With it's, him. it's interesting for sure. Sure enough, the seven million dollar Super Bowl commercial, mm-hmm. <laughs> which so was just the iPhone commercial. He spent the money on the the slot. Ain't had no money to record or actual produce a commercial, and it did his job though. It did. According it did. to the report, yeah. brought back 19 million. Yeah. 200 and, I think it was 270,000 orders or something like that. You spend 7 million to get 19 million. 100. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Just look at that. Look at that reach of the Super Bowl, though. 130 million people. Yeah. You spend that and got it right back. Same. And that's just day one. I think it's a play. What's the play? I think the whole twenty dollar thing, the two hundred and twenty and all that, I think it's a play. What you mean? <clears throat> I think he's lost a, a bunch of his uh core fan yeah. base. I think he lost a bunch of fan base and I think that now I'm do the Robin Hood thing to win over or try and win back a whole bunch of people. Mm-hmm. I think it's a play. And I don't I don't okay. know. It might be sincere. I will see. I was gonna say in defense in his defense, um from the minute he first said that he was doing this apparel years a couple years ago he said he wanted to make it affordable mm-hmm. but he couldn't sneakers too right all of that shit mm-hmm. it's like like the the yeezy pods which basically kind of look like what mel has on just a little higher version so when you drop them you drop them at 200 you flip everything down everything the whole website was 20 dollars. everything shirts pants everything on the site mm-hmm. i'll put a couple of I want to see how the fucking Yeezy sock feels. You see? Oh, no. I, I see. Bottega put out a sock. That shit feel like you, Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> you walking on your fucking foot, nigga. You feel everything. You feel every pebble, every nook and cranny on the ground. I'm like, oh, these socks ain't for me. These ain't for me. You, bare, you like to be barefoot, though. Dog. Barefoot. Cool. I'm not walking around the streets of New Jersey <laughs> barefoot. <laughs> New Jersey. 